the latest version of Dolphin version 2.2 Maestro 7B just dropped and the developer here went ahead and tweeted about it and mentioned a few of its new features in particular but he does go on to mention that new in version 2.2 is conversation and empathy so with a little bit more training now the model can actually give you personal advice and will care more about your feelings and has extra training on long multi-turn conversation what we're going to do in this video is we're going to set this model up on run pods as well as the previous version 2.1 and we'll give them the same prompt and we'll be able to evaluate the new performance of version 2.2 and see whether you actually want to switch to it from the previous version. Let's get started. So the setup for run pods that I'm using is using the previous generation RTX A6000 DP over here. And we'll just go ahead and, and deploy one of that type. Nice. So once we have that deployed, let's go ahead and connect to it. And then we can start to set up Maestro 2.2 on it. All right, nice. Once you're in the text generation web UI, what you'll need to do is inside here in the model. I've just been setting up a 2.1 Maestro 7B, but now we can get 2.2 set up as well. So I'll go ahead and copy that link over there and then I'll just go ahead and paste it in here and then we can hit download to download that particular model. All right, so once we have it downloaded, let's head to the model selection page here and you can see I have both 2.1 and 2.2 both available. I'm just going to switch between both of them one at a time and I'll just show you the difference in their replies to exactly the same prompt one that's going to require a bit more empathy which is an area that version 2.2 should actually excel in a lot more than 2.1 all right so we'll start by testing out version 2.1 over here let's take a look at the prompt so you are dolphin a helpful ai assistant i've been feeling really stressed at work lately i've just woke up today morning and i need to get ready for work what do you suggest i do first go ahead and let it generate an answer for this so this is the question that just gives it a lot of opportunity to be a lot more empathetic than before which is definitely something that 2.1 might not excel in so let's just see what it says so here's this reply first of all take a few deep breaths up calm your mind and body then begin with some gentle stretches yoga da, da, da. and it's just giving a, a little bit of a sort of a morning routine that you might do in case you are feeling stressed let's go ahead and now switch to dolphin version 2.2 so i'll just select it over here and once it's ready now i can go ahead and select load to load the model all right nice so now here it says it successfully loaded the model version 2.2 let's head back to to our notebook over here and i'll just regenerate this request now using the model version 2.2 all right it's generating the response and this is really cool this is amazing work from the developers at Dolphin because it does start by saying firstly it's great that you recognize the stress and that you are taking steps towards addressing it. Here's a suggested routine to help you manage your stress before starting your day. So this is really really cool what it's doing here is just it's saying something that sort of a therapist would say where they say well I'm glad that you're finally taking the right steps you know to help yourself out and it's sort of giving you a little bit of praise just for doing that and that will definitely make you feel a lot better in that that moment in case you had asked this sort of question to an AI like this. So this is really, really good progress from the developers at uh, Dolphin. What I do want to point out is how ChatGPT responds to this particular prompt as well. So here in ChatGPT, I asked it exactly the same question about the work stuff. And it does that by saying, I'm sorry to hear that you've been feeling stressed about work. So as you can see, as far as empathy goes, ChatGPT is sort of still a level ahead of Dolphin 2.2, but that's definitely something that you would expect from uh, an open source model other than that this is really really good progress and it just pushes it a lot farther so should you migrate from 2.1 if you've been using it to 2.2 now if you're doing tasks that don't require empathy and being able to say encouraging things to people then there's no need for you to switch if you're just coding and that kind of thing you can stick to 2.1 but if your chat agent is going to be talking to like your customers or your clients who maybe want to buy cars or want to purchase health services then you definitely want to switch to dolphin 2.0 do as it is a lot better at addressing this type of stuff so yeah that's some really good progress from the dolphin team you can go ahead and uh, check out this particular new version i will leave it linked in my description let me know in the comment section what kind of videos you guys want to see going forward and if you've enjoyed this video we're trying to get to 100 subscribers before the end of the year make sure you head down and subscribe catch you soon peace out